This week on Wheelie Good Tips, we're going to talk about airline travel using a power chair. The first thing to know is that travel is possible using a power wheelchair, no matter how paralysed you are. First thing you do is get to the airport early. That's really important. Then you can take your time because you don't want to be rushed. The important things to prepare for are know your wheelchair. So know the weight of your wheelchair, know the battery type in your wheelchair. If you're as paralysed as I am, you're going to need assistance. In my case, I always travel with one companion who will help you transfer from your power chair into the aisle chair and help you with any onboard needs you might have, such as emptying your leg bag and catheter. When you get to the check-in, they'll ask you what you need. You'll say, I need to take my wheelchair all the way to the aeroplane and then I'll transfer onto an aisle chair. You'll then move up through security, where often they will pat you down and the dogs might come and have a sniff around your wheelchair. And then you want to get to the gate as early as possible too, to meet the staff, let them know about your needs, explain your level of paralysis again, and explain how you'd like to get onto the aeroplane. They have aisle chairs to help go down the aisle of the aeroplane. Your travel companion will do the upper body lift or the standing transfer. And people from the airline will often do a lower body lift. Once you're in the aisle chair, someone will take your power chair away to put it in the hold of the plane. Before it goes, make sure you're happy with it to go. So in my case, I take my cushion off. I also take my foot plate off because the less stuff on my chair, the less there is to get damaged in the hold. Once you've taken everything you need to take off your wheelchair and you're happy for it to go, they will then take you down the aisle of the aeroplane, put your cushion on the seat first, and help me transfer into my seat. So everything's gone well during the flight, and now you've landed. Next process, getting off the aeroplane. If you use a wheelchair, you're always first on the aeroplane and last off. You do everything in reverse. Don't rush, slow it down into your wheelchair. If anything is broken, you've got to let someone know. Don't start screaming and yelling at them, but be assertive and be firm and tell them that it's not acceptable and that you need this fixed as quickly as possible. If anyone's got any comments and advice about traveling, put some comments down below and get out there and travel. See the world.